with five videos coming at you all every week, you are gonna see all kinds of different content on our channel. Today we are doing a video right here at our K River Campground in Moyers, Oklahoma. And if you have not yet, please take the time, go ahead and click that subscribe button because we are gonna keep you entertained during your quarantine. Check it out, it is the Pioneer 700 four seater and we just picked this bad boy up from my friends over at Chapman's Paris Honda Yamaha Paris Texas and my buddy Chucky you all met him in a past video his four-wheeler uh is shit the bed on him hasta la vista baby so I got him a new rig to get the work done here in the campground these little 700s are pretty awesome we already have one that we use on the campground and it's proven to be bulletproof they're not hot rod machines but they are workaholics. These things are pretty much indestructible out here. They've certainly held up the best from any machine I've tested. That is the veteran's cabin we've been working on. I wanna show you what Chucky's four-wheeler looks like right now. It's pretty rough shape. This uh, is Chucky's four-wheeler. He had this when I got the campground. And that, my friends, is the shape it is in. Not good at all. And so this is a pretty big campground. We're like 100 acres, and I've been watching Chucky run all over the place by foot. So we got him a little surprise. Let's go find him. Miss Shara, how you doing, lady? I am doing good. Look at you. you. You're looking beautiful. Adam. <laughs> beautiful, looking gorgeous. What are you drinking there? Oh, uh, yes. How What's, are you this morning? I am better now that I'm seeing oh, you. Oh, you're awesome. Oh, <laughs> man. Have you seen Chucky around? Yeah, he just went home for a minute and he'll be back. Excellent. We'll wait right here. Okay. <laughs> I like the flannel on her, huh? It's oh, a good look okay. on you, Cheryl. Thank you. Yeah, Daryl's going to have his hands full. He's always out there working, man. I tell you, I don't know. He's going to have to keep her closer eye on you, I think. <laughs> How's your day going, man? Um, decent, okay. Yeah? Okay. What's new and exciting? Anything? Mmm, not anything I can think of just yet. Well, I got something exciting. I got a surprise for you. A surprise? A what? surprise, man. A surprise, Adam? A surprise, Chucky. Oh. You ready for it? Okay, yes. All right, let's go. Let's go. Okay. We got your Pioneer 700, man. Whoa. I thought you might like that a little bit better. Same one as yeah. Daryl's got. Except you got the four seats. Let's Whoa. go. Take a look, man. Oh, this is this is probably wow. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Huh? Oh yeah. Yeah, that's that gonna work for you? That's gonna work. Yeah. You got some fancy rims there too. Oh yeah, those are nice. MSA. <laughs> yeah, those are nice. Cool. Take it for a ride. I'll hold your coffee. Okay, take it for a ride. Yeah. Oh yeah. This this is wow. This is cool. Ooh. Built for battle. <laughs> that's right, man. <laughs> You like it, Chucky? Yeah, love it. This is sweet. Good this work, awesome. homie. Hey, I appreciate everything you do here every day. You're a hard worker, Chucky. Oh yeah, wow. This, this is, yeah, this is way more than I expected. Well, you got your own wheels now, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> Rock and roll. But I got something else for you here. Really nice. So these two stickers okay. have to go on your machine. Yes, okay. So everybody knows you're part of the Americans, baby. I sure will. However you want to do it. Let's see where you put them. You put them on right now, put Chucky. Put them on right now? It's all you, baby. Okay. Chucky's got himself a new machine, Tom. Yep. Yeah. When did I get one? <laughs> well, yours looks like it's doing good. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is dead. Yeah. That is just too cold. You are on. Yeah. Wherever, wherever you want it, buddy. I think right there. All right, go good. for it. All right. Yeah, I think right there would be good. That looks good to me. Right about like that. All right. There Increase you go, the Chucky. There. Beautiful. You are in business, baby. <laughs> yes. Thanks, Adam. Yeah. Absolutely, Chucky. Yes. Go, nice. Go kick some ass. Have a good day. Get we'll see work, you later. Get to work and kick some ass. Have a nice day, all right? All right, buddy. Sure. Now that that's behind us, I think it's time for mail time. Roll the intro.
It is mail time and let me tell you, people have gotten the message writing mail time right on the package. Let's us know that it is for the camera use. So if you send us anything, you can send it to our K River Campground. You get the address right on our website. It's www.kriver.com. Make sure you write mail time and if you want, you can write, it's from a stubborn American. <laughs> and we will open up as many as we can on camera. Let's get it started. So this package was sent to me by a lady by the name of Michelle and her husband is a retired captain of the Sheriff's Department and unfortunately this year they lost one of their own. So we're gonna start out with some sad news here. This here is Brian Ishmael and Brian gave the ultimate sacrifice serving his country right here on our own soil in a gunfight. Michelle just wanted me to honor him here on this video and also to tell you about the Blue Ride which she will be holding in Sturgis this year to raise money for first responders. It's gonna be in Sturgis August 9th at Deluxe Harley Davidson's and if you wanna go there and help her cause, it's an honest one and it's a good one. Our service members are not only overseas but they're also here in America. These people are out here dealing with the stuff every day while we're quarantined, hopefully staying safe in our own property. These men and women are out there on the line of fire, really. I mean, risking themselves, not only in the hospitals, but also our firemen, our EMTs, and our, and our police officers. So, Michelle, thank you for sending that and a challenge coin from your department that I will indeed add to my collection. So thank you all very much. And I got a Bell's Ride sticker. Cool, thanks Michelle. So sorry for your loss. Thank you so much for sending me over the information. All right, another package here. Oh, motorcycle mission supporter package with a shop shirt. You know I'm gonna be rocking this all the time. If y'all don't know, Motorcycle Missions was my charity of donation for 2019. Uh, we did as much as we could to try to help them and they just sent me a thank you package. Too cool. They do support for veterans and first responders, so another one that's doing a lot. Sent me this nice card and inside as a note where they tell me that, you know, in the beginning of the year, they were worried about completing the three bikes they wanted to build this year. And thanks to my help, they were able to complete all three of them. And I've got a bunch of thank yous from all the veterans that attend her program, all of them handwritten. Thank you, USMC, Pinky, Matt, all these guys. That is very, very cool. Thanks for sending over Motorcycle Missions. And if y'all are looking for a good cause, I definitely recommend Motorcycle Missions. You can find them online right there. Moving on. And we've got another one that says mail time on it. So we will be opening this bad boy right now. So it's a book by Robert Olson and it's called Time Out. Coast to coast across the US is a dream journey for many. It's a book about riding across the country, across the US, and it's thick. Lots to read about there. Y'all wanna check it out online, I'm sure you can. Thank you very much for this kind gift. It says it came from, oh, Robert Olson. The gentleman who wrote the book sent me the book. So thank you very much, Robert. I will uh, look forward to digging in to your book. We have both written books on motorcycle adventure. That, my friend, is awesome. There should be so many more of them out there, in my opinion. Okay, this one says, Adam, thank you for all that you do and have done. I look forward to coming to the K River and relaxing for a few days. Belt Fed Apparel, first sticker on top. Oh, it's a soft shirt too. Oh yeah, see it's got the American flag and the gun that says come and take it. This is a good shirt, we should. Yeah, that's better. That's comfy. Let's see what else we got in here. Ooh, it's a red glass, very well packed. They were not gonna let this break. Now watch me break it opening it, right? That is pretty cool. And a second glass, one for me and one for Ashley, I would assume. Ooh, I should have snapped into this shirt. That one, I, aha, yeah. I like that one maybe even a little bit more than the other one. Red is remember everyone deployed and they do it every Friday. It's like red shirt Friday. Uh, it's a big thing. Uh, a man that was very dear to my heart, Blaster told me about it. And I did it for a long time when I was on the road. Every Friday I'd wear red. You know, it's, it's just a good way to show your appreciation for our veterans. This is from our friend Gail Wittit up in Minnesota, Cedar, Minnesota. Gail, thanks for sending us a present. I see in here we have got something for Ashley, so I'll have to set that aside and let Ashley open that. And this one here has got my name on it, so this, this one we're gonna open. 
believe. The road to success is traveled by those who believe in themselves. Boy, if that's not a true statement. You've shown you've got all it takes to make great things happen. Congratulations. Thank you so much, Gail. This is very kind of you. So Gail says she recently lost a friend who was hit by a car. She says we lost another angel. And she said that she enjoys our videos every day and tuning in. She's thanking us for making them. And she says she hopes someday she can come live at the K River and help us out here on the property. That is very nice of you, Gail. And yes, you are always welcome out here. Thank you very much for the very kind words in that card. Oh, what do we got here? Is some bondage material? What a gale, what are you into? <laughs> oh, it's a neck warmer. So this goes on underneath your jacket and it warms your neck. Very cool, stops the wind. All right, well, we're gonna be probably doing some Alaska riding up in the cold. This may come in very handy. Thank you so much, Gail. I look forward to seeing you when you come. The last gift we are opening today is from my friends over at Thrash and Supply out in California. If you don't know who they are, Look right down here for the link to their website. These guys make some really rad stuff and they're really cool guys. I've ridden with them across California. And I told them I was going on an adventure and I was looking for some new luggage and I saw they had something that looked really interesting to me. So I have been eagerly waiting because this is going to be my luggage on my first road trip after this whole lockdown. And I've never seen it in person. So we're experiencing this together. I didn't have to cut it open. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Thrash and Supply Company, Los Angeles, California. These guys are wicked cool. So this is called the Mission Bag. And check this bag out, man. That is cool. It's all got Thrash and Supply written down it. Kind of an offset gray. It's got, looks like plenty of molly so you can strap stuff to it. Bottom unzips. So you got separate compartments down there. Comes with a rain cover. And this is how it straps the sissy bar. This is a cool bag. So you can roll it or you can open it from the top too. So if you got it this way on your bike, you can open it here. Or if you set it up on your bike like this, you can, you can just do the standard roll top. You can fit all kinds of things in here, I bet. I wonder if I can fit more in this than I did in my saddlebags on our tent camping review. If you haven't seen that video, you can click the link right here and you can see just how much we could fit in our saddlebags. I'm excited for this bag. I'll give you all a full review on it once I actually use it. So there it is right there. That's what it'll look like when it's full on my bike. This is their catalog. They've got all kinds of good stuff in here, but I recommend just going over to their website. So listen, y'all, that is mail time. If you want to send me something, don't forget, write mail time on the package, and I will try. I can't guarantee, but I will try to get it worked in to next week's video. Also, at the end of today's video, we are going to be giving away some Tecron service. So you guys are out there and your bikes are sitting in storage, a lot of you, with this lockdown. It's important to keep your fuel system safe. So today, I'm gonna be sending some of y'all some Tecron. Stay tuned to the end of the video to see how you could win a bottle for your bike. Another thing that we have been working on here at the campground is our veterans cabin. As you can see behind us, we're getting the siding going, we're getting the cedar going. It's not done yet. We've got some landscaping to do around it, but I am in desperate need of a good carpenter and a good drywall guy and a flooring guy, frankly maybe a tile guy. I need some guys to help me finish this thing. If you are out there locked down on quarantine, you're looking for somewhere to go, want a little side job, I'm looking for the right guys to come down here, spend a few weeks with us, and help me button up this cabin. If you're interested in helping us here, just make sure you go to kriver.com, call the phone number there, or send an email. We'll get through it, and hopefully, maybe we've got a spot for you here and a little side work for you to make a little extra cash while you're out of work. We'd really appreciate it, and I know our, our veterans would too. With that said, you know, we are going to be doing every Friday a Q&A. So if you have any questions out there, y'all, don't hesitate to ask me. Write them online every Friday. I'm going to take a few of those questions and answer them. And, and I won't just pick the easy ones, okay? I'll, I'll answer some of the difficult ones too. So if you got a question, throw it down in the comments. I'll try to get to it Friday. And you can do that every week. Any one of our videos. Throw your comments up there. We'll be scrubbing for them. Ah, the new tree house. It's coming along, y'all. I mean, it is really, really coming along. All the outside is done, the siding's on, the windows are in, it is up in the air. The siding is looking good, boy. That is all milled cedar from trees. We fell right here on this property. Let's take a look inside. Oh, it's locked. Hey, Daryl, did you want to talk to me about the tree house? You got a key? Yeah, there's... You got it looking good in here, Daryl. There's cords. I got wires, but I don't know where you're putting lights. All right. Look at all the windows in here, boy. This will be overlooking the pond out here. And then these ones over here, these all overlook the river. So it's river view, but not riverside. We plan on building a few more tree houses out here in these trees. 
Maybe connecting them all with swinging bridges. I think that would be really cool. And look at the size of this deck. Big old tree coming through the deck. You get out here and a perfect view. It is looking good. And now there's gonna be power and air and heat. Thanks to our main man, Daryl. It's always such a pleasure to have you here out here, Daryl, helping us out with everything. Quit trying to hide behind the wall, Daryl. I got stuff to do. <laughs> <laughs> he just loves the camera, what can I say? All right, y'all, it is Techron giveaway time. So this is how it's gonna work. We have got 500,000 people following us on Facebook. We've got 130 plus thousand people following us on YouTube, yet our Instagram, only 64,000 of you are following us there. What did you say? So I need your help. What I want you to do is I want you to take what bike you would put this Tekron in, whether you're using it to store it or you just want some good engine treatment. Put down in the comments of this video exactly where you want it. Go like my Instagram page. It's adamsandoval.official. Go like the page, put your bike in there as well that you use. And on Friday, I'm gonna randomly find 10 of you, send you a bottle of this and a little surprise along with it. So go ahead, let's see what kind of bikes y'all got. And until the next video, remember y'all, stay stubborn.